Okay, this is the Lamborghini Reventon Roadster body kit that I'm selling. You'll notice other videos on YouTube of a Reventon body kit that I'm working on. This is a different body. I had purchased a coupe and a Roadster about a year ago. This is the Roadster. I had done all the body work on the coupe and the coupe is not for sale. I've spent a good year getting everything perfect and this car does have some issues with the bodywork that need to be worked out as any kit car body typically will have um, some gaps that can be fixed during construction doors don't fit perfectly most kit car bodies that's the case nothing that ever lines up exactly where it's supposed to so that all can be finished uh, during construction you can line things up better add things remove things and get everything to line up the way it's supposed to but all the major parts are here trunk and hood you got the roadster style uh, engine cover here you can see there there's some some body work issues that need to be finished off so whoever buys the kit and builds this car is going to need to know how to do fiberglass work and um, work on any of the imperfections that that exist and again I want to fully disclose what it is we're selling here overall it's in good shape the the major panels are all smooth all the body lines are sharp it's just some of the, the edges are rough you can see along the bottom again this is all very common stuff when it comes to fiberglass body kits um, again I purchased this from a person that makes this particular kit known as the Raven 2 or the RAV 2 body kit based out of Myrtle Beach, uh, Myrtle Beach South Carolina um, so he, he makes a decent Reventon body pretty much the only one out there on the market um, this is it and this is the, the quality of the fiberglass that you get when you buy a kit from him or most of the manufacturers out there that make these bodies the uh, windshield frame is tacked in place but it was a separate piece when I bought the car um, so we tacked it on there just so everything's in place but when I got the car that piece was separate The rear spoiler or rear bumper, we just have it tacked in place. You can see the inner edge is just the back side of the fiberglass where the bottom edge is finished with the fins and uh, the other details um, that make up that rear wing. No exhaust tip that comes with this car. The coupe that we spent a lot of time doing body work on, we recreated that entire rear bumper uh, for the coupe. This one we just tacked down the one that came with the body kit. So you can do whatever you want with it. You can just attach it and finish all the edges and clean up that inner edge and put some sort of a smooth layer of filler on there to make it look good but we spent a little extra time on the coupe making an actual built-in piece for that we changed some things on the ground effects to make it more like the real Reventon so there's some things that we did on our car on the coupe that's the car we're going to keep and build and this one we just decided to sell rather than putting the time into doing the bodywork and, and building it so 
there you have it full disclosure of what you're getting yourself into overall the the major panels of the car are in very good shape very smooth and uh, a lot of the detail is there but it does certainly need its share of of finishing work